Gamers and Gamerettes, welcome to yet another episode of me playing Geometry Dash 2.2. Before we get into today's video, I have a very important question. I saw this meme yesterday and I was curious, how do you play platformer mode? Because I don't do either of these. I play AD Mouse. Am I insane? <laughs> so let me know if you also play this way, and if you don't, let me know how you play. So maybe I'll try it out, and maybe it'll work better. I don't know. <laughs> but I don't know why I'm talking about platformer, because today we're doing gauntlets. Um, there are, I think, five new gauntlets. It's the World, Galaxy, Universe, Discord, and Split gauntlets. The reason why I want to play them today is because I want to level up on my Path of Fire that I bought in the last video. If you didn't see the last one, Highly recommend you watch it. It was a banger. But basically, you need a thousand stars or moons. So I thought, why not just grind the gauntlets? Let's start with the first one that's new, the World Gauntlet. Nivel, which I believe is level in Spanish. So let's see how this is. My icons being different is weird. I wonder if we're going to get any new gauntlets anytime soon. I don't know, maybe he's going to wait for more 2.2 levels to come out and then he'll release more gauntlets. God, this song has so many dead memes in it. You know, I want to try something. I just need to try it. The castle. I just want to try it. I'm going to beat the gauntlets with the castle and just see how it goes. Ooh, this part's nice. Okay, um, this level is definitely not a favorite or anything, but it's cool. I'll say that much. Okay, so this was uh, Spain's entry. So I wonder what the next entry is going to be. Oh, Canada. That makes sense. Before we move on to that level, though, I want to beat it in normal mode now. Okay. Great White North. Okay, this is cool already. I hate how there's a sudden difficulty spike, like, right here. Um, I found this really easy for an 8-star. This may have been even, like, a 7-star. This was even easier than the last one, which I think was a 7-star. <laughs> no, the last one was a 6-star, and it was still easier. What? Top comment is so real. Sometimes I wish Canada was real. Alright, next we got for Fro Frostburn Peak. Chile! Okay, cool. Oh, this one's by like Abstract Dark. Ooh. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, wait, that was really cool. Did you guys see that? There's a little, like, exclamation notification on uh, quests if you have one that you uh, already completed and you need to collect. Man, okay, I think I'm gonna practice mode this real quick. Oh, oh my god, I forgot I have practice mode hack. Oh, oh it's so cool. Well, it's, uh, it's not a hack, it's, it's just part of the game now. Oh, oh, that was cool. This is definitely the best level in the gauntlet so far. This was so cool. Oh, I must have just passed the- uh. Is the time in between death and respawn, like, slightly shortened? Cool. This is really nice. You know, I should start rating these out of 10. I think the first one I'd give, like, like a 6.5 out of 10. I would give this one, like, a 7.5 out of 10. And I'll give this one an 8.5. Cool. I love this level. I'm gonna increase my score. My score is now a 9. I made a shake. Planet X by Arb. I really like the concept of how it always like feels like you're falling. I don't know what this turned into, but I love it. <laughs> Man, this was so cool and so unique. Guys, I don't know how to tell my other cube this, but I really like this cube. I think I may have to break up with my other cube. Oh, so this is USA. <laughs> this is supposed to represent Florida, I think. I wonder if there's anything else I need to spend my orbs on other than like the paths, because I still have 200,000 something orbs. Oh, what? Oh. Okay, I wrote down all my scores for the levels, so at the very end... Oh, Down Under? No way, I just played this on stream like a few weeks ago. This level is like crazy easy for a demon, and I also really enjoyed it, so... And obviously, this is for Australia. This song is terrible, though. Heck yeah. And not a single coin in the whole gauntlet. <laughs> Alright, let's see our reward we got. Cool. I'll reveal all the gauntlet averages at the very end of the video. But next, we got the gal- Oh, these are demons. Yo, that was so cool. <gasps> oh, no. How am I just spamming and still surviving? Okay, the gameplay is a little rough, I'm not gonna lie. But this is one of the most visually impressive levels I've ever seen in my entire life. No joke. I feel like I've seen this on Twitter. Ah, it went too hard. And it's also the Italian entry, which is really funny. I wonder what the title means in Italian. Historian Uppy here from editing. Apparently this means head of the world in Latin. I'm getting a lot of Crystal Gauntlet vibes from this. Ah, oh, dang. Love the song in this part. It's so banging. So banging. I give the gameplay like a 7 out of 10 and the decoration like a 9. Actually, I'll say the decoration is like a 9.5, so... 
I'll have it average out to like an 8.5. I'm really not a fan of the gameplay in the final part of this level. I feel like the decoration is obstructing the gameplay so much that it's like borderline unplayable, but other than that, I really like this level. I'm not gonna lie though, I think we're gonna come back to the Galaxy Gauntlet because I want to finish my quests for the for the coins, and there's two non-demon gauntlets right here, so... I actually played a level a few weeks ago that was in the Discord gauntlet. Astrology. Man, all these gauntlet levels are like crazy good. Cool, no coins. <laughs> Man, this was so good, I gotta give it like an 8. Oh! Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, I got a coin! Yay! One coin! <laughs> whoa, actually, I'm gonna increase my score to a 9. This is actually incredible. <laughs> okay, this is it. I was saying that this was like the coolest level I've ever seen in my life. We meet again, little flower. Do I say 9 again? I think I'm gonna go with 9. I think 9's a good score for this. Alright, next, we got Growing Insane. I always notice that really good levels have really hard coins. Like, you'll never find a really, like, incredible masterpiece with, like, free coins. This was fantastic, too. How can I keep rating them if they're all just, like, incredible? <laughs> oh, 24k. Let's go. I'm gonna give this one an 8.5. You know, I think I'm gonna give Afterlife an 8.5, too. Because that level's great, but... yeah. Next, we got Double Dimension by Girly Ale. Okay. I've never seen a Girly Ale level that I was, like insanely impressed by so i guess the point of the discord gauntlet was supposed to be like multiple paths because i think every one of these levels so far has had multiple paths i think it really adds to the replayability because like when you beat a gauntlet you have to beat it in like the normal mode oh okay i love levels like this wow girly ale really improved as a creator cool yeah wow this is great all right last level in discord gauntlet we got Radiant Glen by Knots. Oh wait, do you guys see that? Every time you touch the ground, it looks like you're splashing in water. Oh my god. Also, that Girly L level, I think I'm gonna give it a 7. Wait, can someone explain to me why my glow here is like orange, but my glow in the comments is like blue? Is that a common bug or is that just for me? Ooh, whoa. I'm between like a 7.5 and an 8 for this one. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with a 7.5 but it is an incredibly strong 7.5. All right, so we're done with the gauntlet. Let's see what we get. Oh, that's cool. All right, let's go back to the galaxy gauntlet. Next, we got fizzy fossils. So far, this gameplay is really fun. Bruh, Knots is in here too? Man, what a team of creators. Like, I hope these guys come together again soon to make something, because this is so good and one of the most fun levels I've played in a long time. What? Guys, the ball is dropping in three, two, one. <gasps> Happy New Year! <laughs> I'm getting tired. I think I was a little overambitious uh, saying I was going to beat all the gauntlets, but I tried. I'll calculate the average of the world and Discord gauntlets now. Okay, so the world gauntlet had a 7.8 average, and the Discord gauntlet had an 8.1 average. And that makes sense. I feel like I definitely like the Discord gauntlet a little bit more than the world gauntlet, but if I were to say overall what my favorite level is... Uh, I may have scored this poorly though. Um, I really liked Planet X. That level was really unique and really cool. But one more thing I have to do before I end the video. This castle icon... I really love it. I think I'm gonna have to break it to my old icon that he's about to get retired. Hey, buddy. Um, I got some bad news. You're getting retired. I'm sorry. No, don't, don't cry on me. Are you kidding? Bro, look, we've had some great times together. We've had the best and worst times in this game together. We've beaten 300 demons together. 300 demons. But look, we all grow up, we all get older, we all have to move on. It's not you, it's me. <laughs> I think it's time for us to go separate ways and I think I wanna be with someone new. And that new person is Castle. <laughs> One more thing before we depart. I just wanna thank you. Thank you for these incredible, what? eight or nine years that we spent together. But I promise you, I will come back to check on you from time to time and maybe be a level with you. You will forever be in my heart and I will never forget you. This is supposed to be a bit, but honestly, this is kind of sad. <laughs> it's pretty crazy how I use the same exact icon set for pretty much the entirety of 2.1. Like the seven years that 2.1 was around, I like never changed my icon set. But yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like in memory of my old icon and I hope to see you guys 
in the next one. Goodbye.